Welcome back everyone. I'll go ahead and show you exactly how to screen record on any iOS 14 device, whether it's the iPhone 6S, SC, iPhone 10, iPhone 11, any iPhone that's supported on iOS 14, or even iPad OS 14. This is exactly how you screen record. Now, what you want to do is you want to make your way over to your settings app, which looks just like this. So you want to go and click on here and you'll come to a page like this. What you want to do is you want to scroll down until you find control center. So it should be up here somewhere. You shouldn't have to scroll down too far. As you can see, it's right underneath the general settings. So what you want to do is go and tap on it. And once you come here, you'll see a couple of different options. You'll see, you know, a lot of the options up here and you will see the screen recording option. Now you want to make sure it's on the top section where it says included controls. If you do not see screen recording up here, you want to scroll down until you find screen recording, which should be down here somewhere, you know, towards the lower half. And you, what you want to do is you want to click on the plus button that is next to it to make sure screen recording is up here. So what we want to do is being able to go into our control center and find the screen recording option. So as you can see, as long as you see screen recording up here, then you are set. So what you want to do, and this is just a test, you want to go ahead and scroll down if you're on an iPhone 10. So if you're on an iPhone 10, 10 R or anything that has a notch on it and no home button, you want to go ahead and swipe down from the top right corner. However, if you have a phone like an iPhone 6S or, or a phone like that has the home button, you want to swipe up from the bottom to get into the control center. So once you're here and you're in the control center, you'll find this little toggle that shows basically this one. It's like a little recording button it kind of looks like. So what you want to do is you don't necessarily want to tap it. You want to hold it down first and you basically want to make sure all these things are correct. You want to make sure that the bottom, whether you want the microphone on or off. Now, some people prefer the microphone off. Some people might prefer it on. So you want to go ahead and tap that. If you have an external microphone plugged in, you want to make sure all that stuff's enabled and everything. Now, once you have all that good, you want to go ahead and just tap on it and you'll see a countdown from three. And all you'll have to do at this point is swipe out of here and just record whatever you wanted to record. So if you wanted to swipe around the screens, if you wanted to toggle things on and off, then you want to go ahead and showcase that. If you're trying to film something on TikTok, then go for it. What you want to do at this point though, once you're done, you want to go ahead and tap on the top left corner. So you want to go ahead and just tap here. It'll go ahead and say stop recording. You want to go ahead and click stop. If you want to cancel it, click cancel and keep recording. But if you want to end it, click stop. And once you're done, you'll see this little toggle come up. You can go ahead and tap on it and I'll go ahead and take you to that video that we just made. So if you don't tap on it, you can always go through the photos app. So click on the photos and you'll basically come here and you can just find the screen recording right here. And that's really pretty much it. That's how you do it. It's automatically saved. You can go ahead and share it, do whatever you want to. It's just a standard video. So that's pretty much how you screen record on iOS 14. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count, so it means so much if you guys can hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my main channel. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.